Hi everyone, it's Tim Ria here wrapping up the day two and the Digital Health uh, Summit here in San Diego. Special guest uh, who was just on an amazing panel with startups and emerging growth companies with John Scully. Um, we have Randy Parker, the CEO of MD Live. Hi Randy. Hi, how are you? Great, great. So we're talking about uh, your background. First, let's start with that and we'll go into what happened on the panel. Okay, great. So um, I've been a serial entrepreneur uh, my entire life, uh, originally, and for most of my career, it's been working in the uh, acquisition of movie content to put on packaged media. And that was? That was back in 1977 when I originally began that company, which is very similar to what I'm doing today. Nobody had ever watched a movie at home, and I had the same opposition of an early stage uh, disruptive marketing type business. Interesting. And tell me about MD Live. So MD Live is a national solution to connect uh, providers with consumers. We operate 24 by 7, 365, allowing uh, the consumer to connect with their provider to be able to do that on an average of about 18 minutes to be able to have better access to quality, affordable care. What were some of the topics uh, you guys discussed in the panel? We discussed uh, during the panel a number of topics, but specifically about the consumerization of healthcare and how the, every person who is uh, currently used to having healthcare where they don't have to actually pay for it are gonna be having to sign a contract to be responsible to have some component of that where they have to pay for it, which will make them more aware to uh, choices and costs. What are some tips that you're getting from John that, that you found super valuable in your experience? Well, I get a lot of tips from John and his mentoring uh, me and, and other entrepreneurs, but specifically how to zoom in and zoom out and how to focus on uh, execution and the experience that we must provide to the consumer uh, and stay focused on that. So you have two Scullys you're working with. Who's John's brother? I do. So I work actually with uh, John and David Scully. David uh, and I work together, uh, unlike John, who has many uh, uh, ventures that and many entrepreneurs that he works with. David uh, Scully, John's younger brother, who was the CEO for at Heinz. Uh, for about 22 years, works with me in a strategic uh, role on a daily basis. Talk to me about, uh, and everybody about, designing around the customer, and in the, in the, I guess in the medical space it's not been the standard. And how does that change the game, uh, creating a disruptive technology company? Right, so healthcare uh, traditionally has never focused on both the experience and the satisfaction we have built products and solutions that focus on providing an experience that has never before been provided in the healthcare space. And we do that from a consumer-centric perspective, using simplicity uh, through the technology so that we can get better adoption of the, uh, the new, t new processes. Randy, what's, uh, what's happening in September? You got uh, something happening in September. Yes. In September, we're going to launch our mobile application that will be available to consumers to have access um, in that basis. I think an important part of that is for the, the actual mobile app will be determining, uh, assessing whether telehealth is appropriate or not. It's important that through the services of telehealth, we don't increase the cost of care, but we are focused on appropriate care and by this application and actually putting in your diagnosis, it will establish whether telehealth is appropriate. And if it is, it will then search for a provider in your area who is MD Live and able to be able to connect with. Wow, that's super cool. Um, tips for entrepreneurs um, from your own experience that can help them through the tough times. Well, <laughs> Exactly. Well, I think that, you know, from an entrepreneurial perspective, certainly when you're entering a space where the market that did not exist, one, consider whether you really want to be crazy enough to do that. And secondly, if you do, don't give up because it's generally, a, it's a, it, you know, it's a timing issue. A lot of people start things and they're passionate and they give up right before it's going to be successful. Interesting. And now what's coming up next for you? 
just continue to uh, build this business in a way that is transformational in the way that we access healthcare. Uh, shortly, there'll become a time when we will not remember not being able to connect with our providers through mobile devices. Yeah, it feels like we live in the future, but not quite yet in this digital health space, but it's coming quickly. A absolutely. So, um, well, how would people connect up with you? What types of folks are you looking to get connected up with? Yeah, so we, our services are offered by uh, self-insured employers, health plans, or individuals that have no health care at all. And they can go to uh, mdlive.com to be able to use our services, and they're available uh, on the web, and they're available through uh, phone as well. All right, Randy. Well, thanks so much for your time and being on the show. You're welcome. Thank you very much for having me.